Hello students, this is Dr. Amar Preet Kaur, a lecturer from Jammu and Kashmir Education Department. In this lecture, I am going to discuss about biocontrol agents. This lecture is going to be beneficial for you because most of my students, they belong to agrarian families. Their family members and uh, their parents, they do farming regularly. And in Kashmir, agriculture is the main occupation. Almost everyone either directly or indirectly is associated with agriculture. Another reason that why this lecture is going to be beneficial because by the use of chemicals which we are using in our fields and in our gardens to control plant diseases and pests have created a lot of problems. These chemicals, they are toxic and harmful for human health. We all are aware about the cancer disease. Almost from a, a decade in Kashmir, there is a spike in cancer cases, specifically stomach cancer cases. And some people, they intellectual people they are relating this spike in cancer cases to the usage of chemicals because the horticulture um, specifically apple trees and the business of apples they have been emerged in Kashmir from last 10 years so there is a connection between the emergence of cancer and the usage of chemicals. However, it is not scientifically confirmed. Moreover, these chemicals, they are harmful for our ecosystem because many, uh, many, many insects and many plants which are beneficial for us, they are also getting affected with these chemicals. In biological control, we control the pests and diseases of our crops and um, trees with the help of natural methods, okay, rather than using chemicals. You people must have heard about organic farming. What is happening in organic farming? In it, we don't use any chemical, okay, and... Uh, in the form of insecticide or pesticide or fertilizers, okay? They use organic manures and they use biological uh, ways to control pests and diseases. The use of biocontrol measures, it reduces our dependence on toxic chemicals and pesticides. The very important aspect of biocontrol measures is to study various life forms that are in our field, such as predators as well as pests, their life cycles, their pattern of feeding, and also you have to observe about their habitats, where they prefer to live. All this information, it will be relevant to the biocontrol strategies. Okay, some examples of biocontrol. Ladybird, okay, a beetle with red and black marking. It is very useful in controlling aphids. I guess you people ha must have seen this ladybird, okay? It is very common in our fields. Dragonflies, they are useful to get rid of mosquitoes. Fungi, which is trichoderma, it is useful in controlling plant diseases. Buchloviruses. They are the pathogens that attack insects and some orthopods. These viruses are species specific. It doesn't mean that they can infect whole category of plants. Okay, they are very specific. 
they can attack only particular species so they have a tendency to become a biocontrol agent okay and they don't have a negative impact biopesticides these are the organisms which are applied to destroy pests they are used to destroy the weeds as well as insects they have two main categories one is bioherbicides and bioinsecticides bioherbicides means those biological agents which can control the growth of herbs or you can say weeds and bioinsecticides the living organisms are their products they can control the pests okay some examples about the weeds are the plants which are harmful for the farmer okay and how they are controlled by biological methods the first example is open shea okay its growth is controlled by an insect and it is known as cactoblastis cactorum another weed it is known as hypericum perforatum and it is growth is controlled by crassulina beetles we have milkweed vines in citrus you can say in orange um, garden and in lemon trees okay the growth of milkweed vines it can be controlled with a fungus which is commonly known as divine and it has a scientific name phytophthora palmivora water hyacinth originally it is uh, present in florida us but in india it has become a weed okay and it is growth it can be controlled with the help of fungus known as cerecospora rodmani now about bio insecticides these are the living organisms or their products which are able to kill or repel insects the first category is sterilization strategy a large number of sterile males okay we sterile the males and then they are released in open okay however they can mate with a female partner but there is no reproduction this strategy it is applied to different uh, insects and one of the example is screw worm another way to control insects is by applying insect hormones or they are also known as pheromones pheromones these are those chemical messengers which help in communication sending alarm signals and making trails or for attracting males okay we have two three techniques uh, which are applicable for pheromones pheromone traps these traps they attract male and become and hands these males which get trapped inside um, these pheromone trap they become unavailable for reproduction another technique is confusion technique in this we actually apply pheromones to the paper strips and we spread it all over the field so what is happening the male gets confused because everywhere there will be paper strips with pheromones and they mimic two females so no female is present but it creates a chaos among the males another hormone is known as molting hormone or acetylcone okay it is known as juvenile hormone if we introduce such hormones it will result in early death of some insects so it can control the insects which are harmful for our 
fields some of the products which act as a insecticide are retinone it is uh, harmful for insects and it is obtained from deris elliptica okay from the roots of a plant which is known as deris elliptica second is nicotine nicotine is obtained from tobacco other product is known as azadirectin okay it is insecticidal and it is obtained from neem plant thank you students for listening to this lecture if you have any doubt you can visit my website that is www.amarpreetkaur.com